kind of a mellow campfire tune for today. Today I want to take a look at Bob Dylan 2, Nashville Skyline, 1969, 70? Lay Lady Lay. One of the few songs that, when I first heard this, I wasn't sure it was Bob Dylan. His voice just sounds, it's killer in this. Um, but it's a great song for practicing bar chords as well. So it's a, it's a good one for just, again, good campfire tune. A lot of chords in it, but it, it's, it's, again, great bar chord practice. So what we're going to do is be working with four or five bar chords. We're going to play a lot of chords as bars that we don't have to. There are A's in here. Sometimes we'll play the A's open. But as the bar chord drill in this, in this tune, we want to play the A bar at the fifth in a shape like an E. So an E shape at the fifth, followed by C sharp minor. So we're moving to the fourth fret and switching from an E shape to an A minor shape. So that change, kind of a diagonal change, down a fret and up a string to C sharp minor. Then down a fret and up a string, down a string to G. So this is the same shape as our A chord in the beginning, and then the same change to B minor. So we have a really neat progression there. A major to C sharp minor, then G major to B minor. A, C sharp minor, G to B minor. And that sequence is the main, um, kind of the main theme of the, of the whole song. Now what we're going to do here though is keep our kind of gentle ballad strum going. Down, rest, down, down, up. And now that up is always going to be across dead or open strings because that's when you're letting go of the bar that you're on, moving to the next one. Now you're not letting completely go, so it's really not going to be open. You're going to hear more um, a click. And this is really good, again, a great bar chord exercise because it forces you every measure to relax at your hand and then grab the next chord. You've got to make sure that you take that split second, that one up, to, to get to the, to the next chord. So anyway, Four sets of those is what's happening. The second time through was always just instrumental. Now he, he repeats that line. So that's the first part of each verse, is four sets of that progression. Now we get into kind of like the answer or the B phrase of each verse where he goes to E, doo -doo 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 -doo, and F sharp minor, and then A. Doo -doo -doo. So it's E to F sharp minor to A. F sharp minor is of course a bar of the second, shaped like E minor, and then this time I would use the open A, so you get, your hand gets a nice little break in here. Doo -doo -doo. And then he always repeats the last line. So we have four times through the A series, twice through the E series, and then twice more again through the A series, and that's a verse. Now there's one other kind of cool section in here, and that now we get a little syncopated part. We need it starts on C sharp minor. I'm calling this part the chorus in the song. So that's C sharp minor for a measure, one, two, uh, two measures, and then some really quick changes. One beat on E. One beat on F sharp minor, sorry, two beats on F sharp minor, and one beat on A. So that's three chords squeezed into one measure. E for one beat, F sharp minor for two beats, and A for the fourth beat. And then you just let that A keep ringing for the next measure. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Second line, back to C sharp minor. That line's much easier. Now we repeat the, the third line's the same as the first. off into the next verse. So, fun one to strum, keep it nice and slow. Again, late night campfire tune. Um, there's an outro. If you want to end it, we, we play the last one of these. And we come from the last B minor into an ascending series of chords, all in the key of A. A, B minor, C sharp minor, D, might as well work on your, your bars out of the A major shapes. That would be barred at the fifth with the um, three notes at the seventh fret, and then end on an A. So, 
kind of an intense workout as far as bar chords are concerned for a campfire tune, but uh, that's what you got to do to play Lay Lady Lay. 